Hey, what is going on everyone? In today's video, I wanna show you how you can earn cosmetics in Once Human Beta 3. Now, if this video ends up helping you out, definitely drop a like down below and feel free to join our Discord channel as well. Trying to get a group of people together for launch so we can all be part of the same server and the same hive and just have a lot of fun playing. So let's get straight into it. First thing you're gonna to wanna to do is hit escape on your keyboard, head up to the Manibus PVE. This is called the scenario. So this is basically what happens throughout the season um, in Once Human. So click on this, then head over to season goals and you'll see that there are uh, kind of different phases of these season goals. So we have the first two sections unlocked the rest will unlock as the season progresses. And then you'll notice up in the top right, right here, there is a season shop. So this is where you, you'll be able to buy cosmetics. So let's click into the season shop here. And they don't have a ton of them for the beta, but there are a few things here. So these are some collectibles, exclusive name cards. You've got some basic fashion items, uh, you know, vehicle skins, uh, home decor, and then you have emotes as well. So the currency that you're going to be using to purchase all of these is called Mitsuko's Mark. And hopefully I said that correctly. And the way that you earn this currency is if we go back to this section here for the season goals and we click in to either of them, uh, you'll see that there are tasks that you can do to earn this currency. So you can see I have one right here I have not completed yet, which is have a weapon with five or more calibrations. So that's something I can easily do, have not uh, done that yet, but I'm able to track this if I want to, and I'll earn 40 Mitsuko's mark for that. So as you complete these for each section of the season goals, you'll also start to unlock um, these rewards over on the left side here. So make sure that you claim these as well, because this is a really fast way to get ciphers and ciphers are used on your skill tree to unlock new uh, individual nodes on the skill tree. And you can see here, if I claim this first one right here, I got 35 ciphers, 40 ciphers, 40 ciphers. So it starts to really stack up the more that you do. And then there's different tabs here as well. So you have your territory tasks, you have your exploration tasks, uh, secure tasks and challenges. So the more you do here, the more of this currency that you will earn. One thing I do wanna point out as well is that in order to unlock some weapon attachments, you need to use certain emotes. So I would always recommend, all of these emotes here are 100 uh, of this currency. So I would always recommend to have 100 of that currency banked and don't spend all of it, just in case you need to buy an emote that you don't have so you can unlock a specific attachment. You'll kind of come across these attachments in the world, um, so you never really know when you're gonna come across one unless you're specifically going after it. So that's just a recommendation that I do have. Now, after you buy a fashion item here, let's say, let me just buy this uh, Tech Geek Mask right now because I think it looks kind of cool. Purchase that, we got the item obtained. And then in order to actually equip it, you're gonna head over to your backpack screen here and you'll see the last tab is cosmetics. So if I click on this, you'll see I have a new item here for the mask. I'm gonna click on that and I'm going to equip it. And there we go. Now I have it on my character and I'm looking pretty cool. Uh, so at least I think I am. Um, so if we head back to the cosmetics tab as well, you'll notice you can actually click on each of these sections and it will show other cosmetics that um, are also in the game. Now, I'm not 100% sure how to unlock these. It just says participate in events. So I'm sure there'll be some special events that you can um, that you can participate in and earn these really cool cosmetics. I'm sure some other stuff, it says, you know, redeem in season shop. Maybe these are things that they'll eventually add to the shop. Uh, let me just get out of that. And then you'll also see that there's like weapon skins that you can get. So this is for like the scar. It says I, per I can purchase it in the shop. I'm not sure if this is even available yet in the beta. Uh, you know, like I said, it's a pretty limited shop in the beta, but I'm sure, you know, all this stuff will be available when um, the full game comes out. So that's really all there is to it. Uh, all you gotta do is do those tasks, un uh, unlock those Mitsuko's Mark currency, and uh, you can just spend that in the season shop and you can get some pretty cool looking cosmetics. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. If this video did help you out, like I said earlier, feel free to drop a like down below to help support the channel. And uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great rest of your day.